women were beginning to understand the degree to which they were constrained. I mean, they had no options, period. And mm. these were highly educated women. They, and then suddenly they find themselves just cooking meals and washing dishes. It was mm. plainly horrible. Mm -hmm. And so you couldn't think of options. How do you get around that? You see? Mm. And uh, the male position on that was my own at the time. Well, what, what alternative do I have? What mm -hmm. can I do? Now the alternative is as clear as it could possibly be. You share. So I have okay. to go and put the garbage out. Mm. I have a PhD in garbage. <laughs> Remember Sarah Gibson Blanding at a convocation uh, was asked, you know, why is it important for girls to uh, go to a school like Vassar and study, et cetera, et cetera, when after all, uh, they're just going to grow up and get married and have children. And her response always stuck with me. It was, I like to think that when my girls grow up and do that kind of thing, you know, the dishes and changing the diapers, etc., their minds will be elsewhere. And I'll tell you, that has sustained mm. me mm. through some of the, for lack of a better term, most yucky, mundane mm -hmm. <laughs> times. My mind will be elsewhere. <laughs> <laughs>